It's been a year since I did one of these. It's the update in the Sony Extra Baseline for the Bluetooth speakers. This is the XB33. Is it going to beat my favorite, which is the XB31? That has been my favorite so far, but this looks promising. Let's get it. So like every year, I get these sent out, the Sony speakers. I haven't got the big one. I'm hoping to get this XB41 in the next couple of weeks, but right now we've got the XB33. So, did I say 41? XB43, my apologies. But this is the XB33, it's the middle size. They do a 23 and I think they do a 13 as well, so that's like a keychain speaker. I don't normally go with those ones because I find them not quite powerful enough for what I like. The XB33 is the perfect size for me, so that's why I'm going with this one first. So yeah, update on last year's. Last year's was a bit of a, hmm, they changed materials and it looked okay, but it was kind of drab in a way, and, uh, and the sound wasn't as good as the XB31 for me. I think the 31 was as good, if not better, and it was also cheaper at the time. So Sony are back again, they bring us the XB33 that looks a hell of a lot different. So this is the XB33, and as you can see, they've gone back to like the XB31 where you have the speaker material all the way around, but they've also got the rubberized plastic on the edges, base radiators on the sides, and they still have the trusty flap on the back. This is definitely heavier straight away than the XB31 and the XB32. I don't know how much heavier, but it is. It just feels substantial in your hand. Get your minds out of the gutter. God, I just... I... <sighs> there you go, it looks very different. Also doesn't have the lights all the way across the front and I'll show you now. What it does have is better lights in the radiator grill. And the lights are really bright on these things and they do go all the way around like so. So yeah, it does, I think this looks really good. It's like in your face, but it looks cool in your face. So, whereas the XB32, it was like they got a bit confused on the XB32 and they didn't know what quite to do. This thing looks good. So let's talk about IP rating on this because these tend to be used a lot around pools and on beaches or, you know, things like that. IP rating, IP67. So you're good for sand and dust, things like that. You got it on the beach, it's not gonna be an issue. And seven, yes, you've got water resistance. So you can drop it in the pool, drop it wherever. You can even drop this in the ocean if really you wanna do that. I don't know why, but it is salt water resistant. And that is really important. A lot of people have these products that are IP x7 or 67 or 68 but they don't tell you whether they're salt water resistant or not salt water will eat away at those seals if it's not no fear with this you've got no problem it is salt water resistant every one of the xp speakers so far up until these have had micro usb for charging but praise the lord hallelujah we've got usb c charging on the xp33 speaker Thank you, Sony. Thank you. It's a shame you didn't put it on this $750 camera I'm using right now that only came out last week. Why didn't you? Another video entirely. We're talking about this, but yeah, fast charging through USB-C. Great. I'm so happy that they've added that. I thought the XB32 was a surefire USB-C and it wasn't and it did my head in. As with usual xp lines you can connect 100 of these things together 100 of these let me tell you are gonna boom 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 100 of these together will sound great you can also pair just one doesn't sound quite as flashy but when you do pair one and you've got two of these on the go you do get stereo sound out of them it's just you know it, it works as a left and a right which is nice you can also you take your calls on this thing and they come through rather loud as you may know obviously if you don't want uh, the entire neighborhood hearing your phone call you probably don't want to use this for phone calls but it does also work for voice assistant as well you also get live sound like you do on the others makes it sound that little bit more very good feature it does drain your battery a little bit more so you can turn it off if you don't want that and you want longevity but the live mode is there 
And let's talk about battery life on this thing. It's just like the other ones. You do get all day battery up to 24 hours, but that depends if you're using live sound and the lights and all the features on at once and the volume you're listening at. I couldn't tell you exactly how many hours I've had out of it because I've not had to charge it yet. I've used it a couple of hours a day for the last few days that I've used it. So yeah, the battery has been absolutely fine for me personally. It just seems to be as good as it was on the XP31 and the XP32. So battery is not a problem. And with the XP33, you get this thing called the X sound. X balanced, I should say. X balanced. It's something that Sony have created themselves. It's what they call the X balance speaker unit, which allows it to reach high quality sound and powerful sound pressure while you're listening to this thing. Gives you a richer, deeper audio experience, they say, and I'll get onto that shortly, but it says it's a more immersive listening experience. Hmm, whatever. X balanced. X balanced speakers. Yeah, I know, you want to know how this thing sounds. Let me pick up my Pocophone F2 Pro. I have a review coming on this very soon as well. Mm -hmm. But anyway, let me set this up on this phone for a second. Bluetooth connected. Well, thanks, girl. All right, I'm back. We're all set up. Connects dead quick. You just heard it yourself. Gives you a nice audio cue. So we're going to play some Bass Rebels music like I always do. Nothing too high because the wife's working in the other room. But you will be able to hear this through the video full outside things like that so here's what it sounds like quickly in my little studio that's got no kind of acoustic anything whatsoever That sounds good. Even behind the speaker, that sounds good. That sounds good. I'm just gonna tell you right now, this is the best Bluetooth speaker money can buy right now. But I'll get into it a lot more. I love this thing. And it looks so cool. Smooth bass. Doesn't distort. It's not even on fault. Just sounds great. I love this thing. Anyway, I'm getting carried away. Be right back. All right, I've got myself together again. So what I'm going to do now, I'm going to jump outside. Well, it's actually that way put us through a door that way, but then that way, and we're gonna play this pretty loud, and my neighbors are gonna be like, what the hell is this guy doing? But I'm gonna play it loud with some tunes so you can hear what it sounds like. I'll be right back. Right, so what I'm gonna do now is let you hear a song, and it's gonna be in stamina mode, which gives you the longest battery, but I'm gonna switch over to the live mode, which gives it even more sound. It sounds fantastic. I'll swap and change it a couple of times through this song. It's got vocals and beats and everything in this, so it's quite a good song to showcase this off with. So here we go. That's standard. Now live. This speaker is fantastic, guys. Awesome. All right, guys, I'm back. So you got to hear what that sounds like, even though you got to hear inside the house, you got to hear what it sounds like outside as well. 
I am blown away by the XB33. I absolutely love this speaker. I cannot wait to get the 41 now because that's it. Sorry, the 43. I keep saying the 41 because that's the other one I've got. The 43 as well because that's even bigger. So it should have bigger sound. And I'll bring you a review on that when I get that. But the XB33 here, the sound on this is superb. For me, Sony lead the way when it comes to Bluetooth speakers. You ain't going to get any better. This thing is awesome. I'll leave a link down there for you. Affiliate link, I just get a little bit of a kickback off Amazon. It's like 2 3%. doesn't cost you any more. And it also gives you the up-to-date pricing. So if you're lucky, you might be able to catch it on sale sometime. But it is worth every penny of its $149.99 price tag. This speaker is superb. I have a new champion, I'm afraid. I will do a versus video for you and show you why it's the new champion. And that will be coming up in the next week or so. All right, guys. Enjoy your Sony XB33 because I love it. Ladies.